So during the story campaign, you obviously have the chance in getting that one time loot. Today I showcase to you regarding getting this amazing legendary jacket, the time worn trench coat. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more cyberpunk, be sure to subscribe and do check out my channel. So this amazing legendary jacket, uh, when you first pick it up, you have an armor value of around that 45. This can obviously be upgraded, so you can wear it till the end if you want, uh, and like the look of this thing. It also comes with four mod slots to a standard, which is great also. So this is definitely worth your time picking up, as it's a one-time thing, as I do believe. And while well, it comes with that main story mission, so you will come across it. Now the mission which gives you this thing is a cool transmission and this is the 8th mission after the prologue on the main story campaign questline. So within this mission you work with the voodoo boys and while well, just before this mission you meet a dude called playside I believe that's pronounced. To be honest folks when I first did meet this dude I said to myself I am taking that jacket and well that's what I ended up doing. So at the end of this mission which I won't spoil for you as it's an amazing one you have the option to draw your weapon on a voodoo leader called Bridget. And this is what I decided to do. Now there are other options here, other dialogue options as you can imagine, which may change the outcome, so be warned. If you pick another option, you may not have a chance to get this jacket. So drawing out my weapon as you'd imagine guys, didn't go down too well from that point. Now after you are done here, you re-encounter Playside. And well, as you'd expect, he has it in for you. Do what you gotta do guys, and take this dude out. Once you are done here, all you have to do is loot that body and take that jacket and that's what's up people and there you have it you get yourself a nice shiny legendary jacket with a decent armor stat score four mud slots and something you can continue on upgrading if you wanna all the way to the end of that story and beyond and guys on that note we have come to the end of the video if you guys enjoyed it leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more cyberpunk guides be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video I upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button but guys thanks as always for stopping by hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one